Now, occasionally in New Jersey, you'll pass the main road. You might pass a little house that says fortune teller. There's probably one right on this road. Now, you, and what are they? Well, they could be total hoaxes, people making money. They can be confused people. They can be people with some occultic powers. A believer is to have nothing to do with this. It is at best false. It's at worst demonic. And that goes also for reading horoscopes, astrology, new age, uh, consulting psychic, psychic hotlines, Ouija boards, chanting mantras in yoga. Those mantras are names of pagan gods and all that. A spirituality that is not based on God is based on something else. Darkness, even if it comes as an angel of light. The demonic realm does contain some supernatural knowledge, but it's dark, it's twisted, and it always leads to the twisting of truth. There are shows on television that speak about these things. Some of it is a hoax. Some may involve real dark forces. And demons can masquerade as ghosts and have knowledge of the past or anything else. All these things are imitations. Fortune telling is an imitation of prophecy and the word of knowledge. Channeling spirits, imitation of channeling, having the Holy Spirit. We've got the real thing. We don't need imitations. 